Good morning, good morning, good morning. Hey, you too. Welcome back to On the Road again with Jay Putt. Like, subscribe, comment, share. We are crossing the bridge here on the other side of, on the west side of Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Because I only I drove from Lowell now, sorry. So 
That's when I was in Atlanta, so it would have been seven hours. That would have been good to go. And then I just keep, re I, would, I would recap hours or I get back hours daily until I take my 34 again. But, uh, it's a little dark out, nice little morning ride. Six or three degrees out this morning. Um, so they got, uh, I should be there. I got, once I get into Houston, I gotta take a couple of detours here and there for my route. Cause I am 12 wide, 90, on the 95,000, 93, 95,000 pounds. I'm not heavy, heavy. Just over the legal way. But, uh, you know, it's all good. I just want to come to you all this morning. Say good morning to you. I will stop and get fuel here in a little bit. We'll go from there, good people. I will holler back at you all in a little bit. My bad. All right, people, we are in an hour and a half or so delay. I've only gone 13 miles in the last hour, hour and a half. But yeah, this is ugly. I'm thinking that tanker over there to the left. I don't know if y'all, yep. I don't know if that's involved or what, but this right here, I am going to assume it's fatal. More than one fatality or what, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, that tank is off to the left. Ain't nothing good about that. There's nothing good about that. That's a fuel tanker. Hopefully he was trying to avoid somebody. Let me slide over so I'm sorry, sorry about the shaking there. We got somebody off in the woods right there. Oh my gosh. That ain't my... No, that's not good. Two cars in the woods. Oh, it's a car hauler. Somebody came across the median, like the car hauler came across the median. Yep. Wow. Going to a, that's, that's a mess right there. That is a mess. Anyway, we're back on the road here. It's been a long, I don't know, it might have been an hour. Yeah, yeah, I did. Uh, 
probably about 40 miles east of San Antonio. Got it over there, headed back to Griffin, Georgia. Right now I'm back in Georgia, as you can tell, West Point area. We'll be uh, getting up here to Highway 16, Georgia 16, making a right turn, heading straight to Griffin. Getting unloaded there, and I gotta hit shoot straight down to, back to Palatka, Florida. About a 350 mile run. Pick up a trailer to head up to Swanee, Georgia. Try to get loaded tomorrow afternoon, about noon time. That's what time I'm, well, they want me there tomorrow morning at 8, but that ain't gonna happen. So we're trying to get a load time at 8 o'clock tomorrow. Get there, get loaded, and head to San Diego, California. <laughs> yep, yep, San Diego. So, if all goes well, I'll be in San Diego Monday next week. God willing. But uh, we're gonna make it up this road and uh, keep it moving. I am, uh, I don't know, looking forward to the trip. It'll be about a three day, three day trip over there. Three day, three driving days, three and a half driving days, really. Uh, if, I, if I can make 600 miles a day, it'd be three driving days. That should be to do that. That's about 10 hours a day what I want to be able to do to now the drive of the day. Um, so we should be able to keep driving straight through that way I make up time. You know, and that way it'd be ten and a half hours, ten, yeah, ten and a half hours of um uh, of my work day as well. Make that happen because I should I'll be oversized yeah not that way. But anyway We'll talk about that when we get on it, but that's my schedule for the next week. Next five, five to seven days. Um, right now, I think we should get to uh, Griffin at about right at 2 o'clock. Get out of there at 2.30. Four and a half hours down the road. Four and a half, five hours down the road. Um, make it happen. Make it happen. Make it happen. How much time we got left to make it remaining time late? We got an hour and 24 minutes, which makes us two hours or an hour and two, yeah, two hours and 20 something minutes. I mean, I get five, yeah, we have five hours to run down there. Barring any uh, issues, get down there, get out the clock as soon as possible. Get back on the clock in the morning as soon as possible and hit the road, Jack. Anyway, I just wanted to come to you all real quick, let you know what we got going on. I will get back with you as soon as I can. Good evening, good evening, good evening, uh, YouTube. Uh, well, good night, rather, how we want to say it. It is about 10 o'clock. I'm down here in um, Palatka, Florida. I'm um, getting ready to uh, shut it down for the night. Got my trailer. We've been, we've been making some miles in the last couple of days. That good people. Uh, like I said, I made it out to Texas. I think I'll tell y'all that. San Antonio. We got there Saturday afternoon. Um, and then got shut down. Yeah, we shut down for our 34. Left out Monday morning. Yesterday we did 652 miles. And uh, 10 hours and 37 minutes. We did 696 miles in 10 hours and 43 minutes. Uh, tomorrow we're gonna probably do another 600 miles because I gotta get to uh, Swanee, Georgia, from Palatka. That's about 400 miles, and then try to get another two, three hundred miles down the road. So I'm trying to get to Alabama. I don't know which way my, my permit gonna have me going. Well, I'm trying to get out of Atlanta as soon as possible. Cause I got, to get, I got to be in San, uh, hopefully, San Diego on Monday. So that's about 600 miles a day. Wouldn't be bad. I just got to make sure my time. What I got left? I got 46 hours and 58 minutes left, and I got 37 hours of driving to do. 
including this six hours for tomorrow, so that's 42 hours. Woo! I'm just gonna make it. Just gonna make it so I got to conserve all my time. I gotta make sure I, sh I shut down as quickly as possible. But uh, we should make it. We should be alright because I'm only once I get loaded. I'm, I'm we hitting the road, Jack. We hitting the road. Once, well, yeah. Once I get loaded, we should be be good because I'm gonna I'm gonna drive all day tomorrow, Thursday, well, all day Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Shut down Saturday, and I think I'm not supposed to be there till Monday at. Let's see here. at 8 o'clock in the morning, but I'm pretty sure that's that's a flexible time frame. But we'll make that happen. Um, when you got me a few little items from Dollar Tree while I could. Um, you know, some water and stuff. I got to get fuel tomorrow. So I'll, I'll be in Swanee tomorrow about 1 o'clock. That's going to make it rough to get out of there. Like I said, it just depends on which way my permit has me going. If it has me going back down through Atlanta, I hope I can just get out of there about 3 o'clock. Um, and start hitting the road. I'm only, I'm only going to be overweight. I'm not going to be over over overdimensional in it, just overweight. So I won't have to run flags or banners. I should be able to run day and night. And what I may do is just get outside of Atlanta, shut down, get an early start on Thursday morning, hit it 10 hours Thursday, 10 hours Friday, 10 hours Saturday, shut down early if I can get off the road Saturday. Well, it depends on how early I get out of there on Friday to be able to shut down early Saturday afternoon. Shut down around 12 or so. That means I'll have to be on the road by 2 in the morning. But we'll see how my time backs up. And that way I can, um, if I got road by 12 Saturday afternoon, I won't be able to get back on the road until Monday at, no, Saturday, Sunday night at 10 o'clock. So if I can do that, well, it just depends on how far I got to go. So it just depends. I got a little leeway with that. But anyway, uh, other than that, truck running good, trailer running good. Um, just got to get up here and get this load tomorrow and uh, keep it moving. Keep it moving. It's a good paying load. Um, it's a good paying, paying load. But we'll, uh, we'll make it happen. Um, try to get a little road footage on the way out there and all that kind of good stuff y'all on this journey with me uh, um, other than that good people y'all keep being good to one another uh, love yourselves love one another fist bump say hello you know do something for somebody else besides yourself other than that